how are you doing? It's Elaine Bintz, certified health coach and personal trainer. It's day 28 of our challenge. Can you believe it? I cannot believe we only have two more days. Um, so today's movement is another abdominal exercise and it's bicycles. Uh, you'll notice I'm already wearing ankle weights. So if this particular movement, it can be done as a body weight exercise. But if the body weight movement is getting too easy, I suggest throwing on some ankle weights while you do this move. So I do suggest if you are working out on, even on a carpet or on one of those uh, pads, those mats that you have in the gym, I would still use a mat because this is a lot of pressure on the vertebrae. Um, so what you wanna do is you wanna sit down on the mat and then you wanna have your body in a position where your head and neck are supported. So your hands are interlaced and bring your hands behind your neck. And then the movement is is an opposite movement. So it would be right elbow, exhale, to left knee, and then left elbow to right knee. So this movement, you'll notice if you are using the ankle weights, it's a lot more challenging. The breathing is you exhale when the rib cage closes down toward the hips. So if you're standing up and you wanna see this particular move, you want to lay down while you do this exercise, but if you want to see the breathing, it's exhale as you bring the knee to the elbow, exhale. So if you're in a natural rhythm of doing this exercise, it's inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. And your body would get used to that movement pattern. And the reason you breathe in that particular rhythm is because as the ribs are closing down, on the lungs, you wanna exhale. Um, and that goes for pretty much any of the motions you're gonna do, you wanna exhale on the effort. All right, again, this is Elaine Bitt, Certified Health Coach, Personal Trainer, and these are the Strength Exercise Bicycles. I look forward to seeing you guys tomorrow. Have a great day, bye.